There's been a disturbing video circulating on social media that shows a white couple harassing a black man for walking around in the neighborhood. Um, now, I want to start off with the update to the story, which is a good update. Um, the person seen harassing the black man in this video has luckily been arrested. But when we come back from the video, I'll tell you who he is and why this is a problem, not just in this story, but when it comes to the US military and policing in America. Take a look. Go away right now. Call the police. Hey, they've already been called. They're just I'm waiting. Fight for who? You Let's know go. what? Maybe you should hang on a little longer. We'll Let's see go. how it goes. Then we won't have to get the report by ourselves. What is it you're doing here? Walking. Then walk. walk. Okay, and that's what I was doing. So she came out of house. Ran well, you've been here like 15 minutes now. Let's go. Walk away. Keep walking. Walk oh, away. Man. I already walked away. Walk away right now. You need help? You got this one, Kenny. No, I'm happy to help you. Uh-uh. Uh, I didn't no, hit you. No, 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 no. There's a difference no, between pushing sure you. You're the aggressor, buddy. You're aggressive on the neighborhood. Right. Right. Someone came running out. Oh, you better walk away. Some you walk know. away. You You're talking to my wife right now. That's your wife? Walk yeah. away. I didn't do Walk that. away. Check it out. You either walk away or I'm going to carry your ass out of here. Dude, you touch What do you want to do? You better not touch me. Or what? What are you going to do? You up on me. Let's go. Walk away. I didn't do anything. I'm about to do something to you. You better start walking. I do anything to her. You better start walking so right now. You come after me like that? I ain't coming after you. You're in the wrong neighborhood, mother. Get out. Is he in the wrong neighborhood? Why would he think he's in the wrong neighborhood? That mm -hmm. seems strange. Uh, John, we have just. Uh, Mm -hmm. Sorry, I think he just wanted to add that on to the end so that you understood the entire context of who he is and what this little thing is about. I think it's pretty clear with that last comment. So for those of you wondering, the person in the video doing the harassing is Jonathan Pentland. He is a US Army Sergeant First Class. Pentland has been at Fort Jackson in Columbia since at least 2019 and has worked as a drill sergeant at the garrison. According to a document from the Secretary of the Army, Pentland was promoted to Sergeant First Class in April of 2020. We're not done showing you what that interaction looked like. We have one more video. Let's take a look at that. Get out. Where? Where's your house? What's your address? Maybe we should walk you home. Walk you home? Well, you bet. You want to bet what I can do? I live here, sir. Okay, right now, you're address? harassing the neighborhood. I'm not harassing anyone walking through the neighborhood I live in, sir. Where? Okay, check, check it out. We are a tight knit community. Okay. We How take care of each other. How long have you been a lot longer than your ass, because I have never seen you before in my life. How long have you been living here? That's Why does that even matter to you? How long have you been living here? Doesn't matter. You know what? Get the hell out of my face. Get out of my face. You walked up to me. Check it out. I ain't playing with you. You either get your ass moving or I'm going to move you. You smell drunk. You want to bet? You are drunk. I'm you about to show you what I can do. I would suggest you better walk away. Walk away. Walk away. I'm walking. You keep following me, sir. The only one way out of here is right over there. So uh, shortly before we went live today, uh, what broke in, in response to this story is the fact that Richland County Sheriff uh, Leon Lott has addressed this incident by arresting uh, the real harasser, uh, which was the um, US Army Sergeant that you saw in the video. Uh, the sheriff confirmed that Jonathan Pentland has been arrested and charged with third degree assault and battery. Uh, the charge carries a maximum penalty of $500 or 30 days in jail. And uh, if you're wondering what the military had to say about this, at first uh, there was a response about how um, you know this isn't something that we condone. Let me get you the exact statement. This is by no means condoned by any service member. We will get to the bottom of this as soon as possible. And then, you know, later the sheriff's department was like, ah, there's a lot of misinformation out there. We don't know what's going on. But now we know that Pentland has been arrested for what he did. And there's apparently stuff that happened off camera, stuff that we did not see that led to this conflict. But he's. A young man who lives in the neighborhood, and since this, you know, army sergeant has never seen him before, he's a threat.
He doesn't mm-hmm. belong there, he needs to leave. And just think about how if you don't look a certain way, you're not gonna be questioned like that. That's just the point I wanna make. A hundred percent, yeah, yeah. And he's not even, he's doing all of this on film. Like the fact that everybody has a video camera, one would have thought it would have moderated our behavior a little bit to be a little bit more social. But um, no, no, people are still just as terrible. He's proud of every bit of that. Um, he's talking about it exactly like any, let's just keep it real, any racist would. You're in the wrong neighborhood, we're a tight knit community. We watch out for each other, all that stuff. Um, you know, it like less than a century ago, there were sundown communities. Now you have the racist drill sergeant who's talking about how he's harassing the neighborhood. Dude, just walking. Like, imagine a neighborhood where you can't walk around without some apparently drunk smelling skinhead walking up to you. That does seem like kind of a bad neighborhood. He sort of has a point, he's demonstrating it right there. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad that he was arrested. I don't know what's wrong with our country. I don't know why people are so terrible to each other. But the 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 fact that we all have video cameras makes us constantly aware of it, at the very least. And the sheriff, who again initially refused to release any type of strong statement about what happened, and then later announced that um, you know arrest an arrest was made, um, is now saying that the young man was a victim and he will not face any charges. Okay, great. Um, the sheriff, Sheriff Lott, also confirmed the victim is not a juvenile. Um, so uh, he obviously looks very young, uh, but he's not a juvenile. And uh, clearly, he was doing absolutely nothing wrong. We know that based on what the police have found through their short investigation. I'm, I got to be honest, I'm actually pretty surprised at how swift the action was. I really didn't think um, that there would be consequences for him. So mm-hmm. now the real question is, what will the military do? Are there consequences in that regard? And look, the problem with the military and policing is we know there's evidence showing that white supremacists have intentionally infiltrated local police departments and the military with the intention of carrying out you know, their, their race war. And even though we've had that information for how long now, nothing's done about it. There isn't a robust investigation into white supremacy within the military's ranks. None, none. We don't hear anything about it. Mm-hmm. So yeah, uh, people this like Biden are scared because mm-hmm. we know what happens whenever anything like that is talked about, let alone announced. The right wing would absolutely lose their mind. The Tucker Carlson has done multiple shows this year about how it is completely illegitimate for any branch of the U.S. government to be concerned at all about domestic terrorists, white supremacists, any of that. 